Based on the dynamic model proposed in the book Double Helix of Philotaxies, this video demonstrates the unity of the morphogenesis of all forms of spiral philotaxis. According to this dynamic model, a new primordium appears at the center of the inflorescence at equal intervals of the time. Moreover, each primordium increases evenly in its size. As new primordia appear and grow, each primordium puts pressure onto others. As a result of this pressure, each primordium moves in a straight line from the center of the inflorescence. Let's color each new 8th primordium in blue, each 13th in red, and each 21st in green. Notice how the computer simulation of the dynamic model matches the real philotaxis pattern of a sunflower inflorescence. Let's convert the planner 2D view into the isometric 3D view. The transformation of a flat philotaxis pattern into a cylindrical one occurs as a result of the rapid growth of the central part of the receptacle along the axis perpendicular to the plane of the flat pattern. Like any model, this model is a simplified representation of the real process. Notice how the computer simulation of the dynamic model matches the real philotaxis pattern on a pineapple. 